Also right now at 5, the Hartford Public School District facing some financial trouble for the upcoming school year. In fact, the district is looking at a $77 million deficit. Channel 3 Hartford Bureau Chief Aya Galal spoke with the superintendent today. She is joining us live now. And Aya, any word on what exactly will get cut? Aaron and Mark, the superintendent says it's still too early to know for sure, but the district is hoping that some state funding can help. But many parents are not happy. It's, it's disheartening because we were already short. Tashala Williams is a community advocate and parent of a Hartford Public School student. She's concerned about what this budget deficit will mean for thousands of students within the district. How are we going to educate these children? How are we going to honestly say that we're providing them with a quality education when we are basically sitting around the table trying to determine how much of this turkey we're going to cut off and still call it a Thanksgiving meal? The district is currently looking at a $77 million deficit for the 2024 to 2025 school year. Superintendent Dr. Leslie Torres Rodriguez says two of the major factors are COVID relief funds expiring and inflation. Uh, what we know is that the expenses are outpacing the revenue that's coming in. The superintendent says it's too early to know what will get cut from the budget. Uh, can two schools share a music and an art teacher if they're, you know, within close proximity of each other? You know, those are the conversations that we're now we're now having. The district hopes additional funding from the state can help as well as sub grants. How we're going to sunset uh, some of the programs or not. And, and if we're not, how are we going to get there so that we can still maintain uh, the integrity of supporting our students. Meanwhile, parents are concerned about what this could mean for the future. But we have to compromise to the tune of $77 million. We're not offering quality education if that's the compromise. And the district is still in the early budget process. It is slated to be approved in April. In the meantime, the district is holding several public forums in which families can weigh in on their concerns. Live in Hartford, Agnel, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.